When I was a sophomore in college, I met a guy who confessed to me that he could not get off without thinking about, touching, or looking at these. Oh, fetishes. I would eat this girl's shit. Stopped at a gas station in a hotel, pulled down her pants, told me to open my mouth. I love all of my fucking whores that Jeez. like to watch me puff Dropped in a couple of you. on a big stogie. My lungs filled Hello. with her methane as I sucked out fart after fart. She didn't even care. But they lie all the time. I, have you been in government? No, I have. All right, so that for it's time to the NFL going to watch a football why, game. Why, and what's okay, going on. why do we have the CIA embedded in all state government when their mission statement says that they're not? <laughs> Why don't you two girls squeal for me like little piggies? Just had to want to talk about one of the things. What did you do at the Bilderberg meeting? Meeting with world's elites in secret? Why are you so scared to say something? Yeah, for us. So, uh, he kind of went along with it for a while and finally asked, well, you know, what's, what's yeah, the game plan? What are you guys after? And uh, according to Russo, uh, Nicholas Rockefeller told him, well, we want to microchip the population and, and let the rich people control the world. That's it. That's exactly what's going on. But people can't see it because they're caught in the matrix, the electronic matrix that surrounds them 24-7. Hey, you look familiar. Oh, is that a shit? Uh, I, I, I love... No, no, no! Your ears are just ringing like crazy. Right. But now, now let's get real. What's put up to you? George W. Bush and Barry Sotaro Obama. The incinerator. The handcuffs. The incinerator. Okay. And whoosh. And I can let me detail that for you and say what I'm talking about. Then in 2008, oh, we got change. You can believe this. And we got Barack Hussein Obama. Check out his uh, cabinet. Oops, Robert Gates, CFR. He's still there. We've got Hillary Clinton, who attended Bilderberg meetings. We've got Janet Napoleon. We could have been in California with lots of good cops. But instead, we're here in Alabama so, because you Nothing. wanted wine. All they did was change.